Hello, my name is Ricardo Cadena with the Avaya Serviceability Engineering Team. This video is about downloading the SIP message log from an Acme Packet NetNet C Series Session Border Controller. The following procedure applies to Acme Packet NetNet 3800 and NetNet 4500 Session Border Controllers. We demonstrate the downloading of the current SIP message log file. First SFTP or FTP to the SBC. We will use the locally administered SSH username and password. The user and admin accounts could also be used. After authenticating, navigate to the RAM DRV directory. Then to the logs subdirectory. You may list the available log files. There could be up to 13 OneMeg files available for download. If there are multiple files, all names will begin with sipmsg.log. Sipmessage.log would be the current file. The next oldest would have a .1 appended to it, while the oldest file would be appended with .12. Use the appropriate download command for your method of access. We run the get command. When the download is complete, use the appropriate disconnect command. We use quit. You can now access the downloaded file to investigate SIP message content. For more detailed information, reference Acme Packet product documentation. Thank you for your time today. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details or related information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.